Hi, y'all. All right, we are going to do an experiment. This is gonna be hard for us to see. Oh, here, are we good? Can you guys see us, hopefully? All right, we're gonna show you right now the difference between a counter cloth, a Norwex counter cloth, ta-da! And paper towels. And paper towels. So what we're gonna do is hold up yours. We're gonna put in a fourth of a cup of water in each of these containers. How am I gonna do this? I'm not sure. Okay. So I poured in a fourth of a cup here. Now bring this over for me. Here you go. Ready? And come back. Good job. And we're pouring in a fourth of a cup here. <laughs> You're gonna creep. Don't be creeping them out. They're gonna be like, "Who's that? Look, he's oh, fixing God. the rain shed." Hello. <laughs> All right. So what we have here are our two fourth of cups of water. We should have put this higher. Okay. What Gracie's gonna do is she's gonna take four paper towels. Good job. A lot. Yep. And Samuel, say hey. Hi. Samuel oh, is going to take a counter cloth. Now put the counter cloth in there. Let's make sure that y'all can see it. All right, you're going to do four. Go ahead and put it straight in. Just crumple Watch it this up. Deal. Yep. Okay, and Gracie, how many do you have? Four. Do one at a time so they can see. I mean, y'all are gonna love this. You're just gonna love it. Okay, there's the counter cloth. All right, go ahead and put in. Can you guys see it? Can you see it, Sam? <laughs> go ahead and put it in. All right, one paper towel. Keep going. Okay. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Two paper towels. Okay. Three paper towels. One more. Close. Four. Four paper towels. All right, and I got it. Okay, so four paper towels got all of the water, the fourth of a cup of water. So, but right, I mean, you're going to throw this away. Hello, throw in the trash. Right? Waste. You buy it, you waste it. It's get thrown away. This? Look at that! No need to. And there's still some dry. Like, do you see that? It's amazing. All right, y'all. We love these counter cloths. You can use them. I will use them wet in, like, the kids, like, um, like lunch boxes, or if we travel, or if you're going to the store, get it wet before you go to the store. Wipe down the grocery cart. Um, you can use it inside the car or the vehicle if you have, like, spills or anything like that. You just get it wet. Sometimes I'll just have a quick water bottle, or spray bottle with me. You can wet them as you go. Can you see you? But these counter cloths, y'all, they save a bunch of time. Oh, go get the house. Go get the house. So the counter cloth box set is a really great way to save money on paper towels because it's sort of like a paper towel roll. So it's like on Except your counter. The house. Right? Okay. Scoot down a little bit, baby. It's higher. This is the place where the counter cloths live. So the counter cloths live here. Some people put zip ties here, and then they can have le levels. Levels? Wait, wait, like another house in your house, what would you call that? Another story. Another story in their house. Some people hang this on their wall. You can hang it on the wall. Or we just set it at our dinner table and we use these as cloth napkins. Or you can roll them and put them in a cute container and put them with your, we have awesome eco, eco utensils right now. Um, these are amazing. I love them for the summertime. They're like a limited edition Norwex item and plant-based, right? So they're plant-based and they biodegrade in like six months. Okay, the countercloth box set does come in three different colors. So you can get a purple, a gray, a or, a blue. or a blue. So you have three different color choices um, and then you can mix and, mix and match. Your countercloths, you come, you get, I can't talk, you get six countercloths. So this is one countercloth, you get six of them in the house. So if you have not um, tried this yet, this is where you can have this out and you train your people that this is their new paper towel. And remember, it has silver inside, right? It's so absorbent, it's amazing. Make sure that you're deep soaking these too. We love to deep soak. We love to recommend that you deep soak. With the booster. With the booster. Probably every two months, specifically for the counter claws. 
because the counterclaws are around food, right? Grease and food and all the things. Um, so make sure that you're deep soaking them every couple of months, every two months or so. All right, y'all. We love these counterclaws. They're our favorite thing. Save you a ton of money. Americans spend like $200 to $400 on paper towels. So think about that. You buy a counterclaw box set one time and you wash these products. Use them over and over again. They have the silver inside. They're going to self-purify. A lot of people, they'll like wring out the water in their cloth and then they'll just hang their cloths to dry. We'll hang ours on like our sink, like the handlebar in our sink too. But genius, wonderful way to save money, especially right now in this season. Okay, really quick too, I just want to show you all this. This is the dishcloth. So just so you know the difference between the dishcloth and the countercloth, the dishcloth is mesh. I, I use it full that. size. And why do we love it? Because it prevents stinky sponges. Oh my word, doll. If you hate a stinky, smelly sponge, you've got to get the dishcloth. The smelly sponge harbors like literally millions of bacteria. Ugh, nasty. So all the bacteria just rinses away out of your dishcloth. You scrunch it up. Most people are really unsure. This is the product so they're they most cut unsure it up of. In halves or you can fourths. cut it in half, you can cut it into fourths. Um, I like it the full size. So I recommend you try it the full size first. Add your soap, wash your dishes, and then you simply hang it to dry. Right? Because that's it. And then wash it as needed. Sorry, you good? Yeah. Maybe wash it at least once a week. Um, but, y'all, that thing's going to save you a bunch of money because you're not going through sponge after sponge after sponge. I think I replaced one of our dishcloths after four years. Um, it lasts for a very long time. And, again, no stinky, funky, blah. You don't have to worry about that. Dishcloth's one of the Slate's favorite products. Highly recommend it to you. You'll love it. It does look funky when you start, but once you get used to it, like it's one of our top, top selling products and our favorite product in our house as well. So you're going to save time there and you're going to save money because it's so scrubby. So All right, y'all. Bye. Thanks for watching. Bye.